video number three of today. Lord Garmadon finished that unboxing. Unlike the Wu video last last time, I'm gonna get this. I'm gonna give you a close experience of me digging my fingernail into there. Man, that really hurts. Oh no, I damaged this one way lot more than the last one. Oh no, um... Yikes. Anyways, this one has, this set has 23 pieces, some of the three weapons, and one minifigure, like all other Shinra sets do, besides for the battle pack, or story pack, or whatever you call it, which comes with two minifigures, but I don't know that. I don't know why, but it just seems like a strange choice to give us green with Garmadon. I think they're blue and white, I get, but... Anyways... So this banner was released in 2011, and originally retailed for ten for $9.99 or $10 in the United States. He has no leg printing, or back printing. And, what else was I saying? And it got this for $15 at Hidden Treasures, even though it's worth like $35 ish, $30 ish on eBay. And again, this is cheap plastic that isn't ABD or whatever they use. Comes with three bricks that you could use to customize your spinner. You could, you could combine the hover piece and the spinner and that green brick to a uh, do that if you wanted to. You could add these two on the sides. The newer spinner have studs in the holes. Uh, holes in the studs. But this one doesn't. I'm for sure each one comes with a golden weapon. Let me look at, let me look at these destroy packaging. Yeah, they all come with one golden weapon. At least. It's not more. But well, since they lose, we're all golden. Here's what it looks like. And we're gonna spin it up against the other ones. The instructions are also pretty normal instructions. Oh, the instructions tell you how to play? I didn't realize that. That's cool. You can only play a battle part card if your character has equal or more power. Yeah, like, Sensei Wu had three on of each power, and so does Garmadon. So. <clears throat> Basically, spin them against each other, you could only play them. Play cards anytime during the battle. Each card can only be played once. When a character falls off, the character still standing wins, and the winner takes one of the weapons and is held by the uh, and held by the losing character. The winner takes one weapon held by the losing character. After you finish playing, return any weapons you won. To the player they belong to. Oh yeah, that's nice. They they tell you to return it to their original owners. Anyways, uh, let's bring the spinner to my desk. These are definitely very odd Legos. Oh, they're also completely transparent, which is sort of weird. When I said weird, I meant cool.
I'm just gonna scoot my Wii that Wii that I unbox to the side. So I can compare it these two. Here's the loose spinner ready to go. Here's Garmadon, also ready to go. And last time I got a couple cool cards. Let's we'll see what I get in this one. Oh, that's so satisfying. Garmadon. Has no text besides for the Garmadon. Three power of everything. Double trouble. Um. Take any two weapons if you win. Okay, cool. Finders keepers. When an opponent's character win if a, an opponent's character drops a weapon. That's probably not gonna happen, but okay. These are two our electricity cards. Both electricity cards. An earth card. Shadow Spear. Give up headgear to cancel an opponent's card. And card freeze. Opponent cannot play cards until a player wins. Hmm. All three of these use two power. There's a ice one that uses two power, earth one that uses two power, lightning one that uses two power, and the double treble uses three power. But Wu and Garmadon both have three power of each element. Perfectly balanced as all things should be. So. What was I doing? I'll spin these two against each other, but I might need my brother for this. Uh, spin two battling will have to be its own separate video. But let's use these cards. Take any two weapons if you win. I'm not gonna actually battle them, but I'm taking two, two of those weapons. Finders keepers. If the opponent drops their weapon, then you could keep them. I'm taking this too. Shadow Spear. Give up headgear to cancel to cancel an opponent's card. And freeze. Opponent cannot play cards until a player wins. This is how it would look if I used all my cards. And this. is how Woo's would look if he played all four cards, cards at once. Anyways, that concludes my video for Garmadon Spinner. Thank you for watching, have a nice day. Oh wait, I almost forgot. Even though this character has almost no printing, besides for some on the chest, this is how he looks. Completely barren on the back, but has some skull chest printing on front. But that doesn't show up on camera because how dark it is. You can see it now. Anyways, bye.